Five people are recovering from their injuries this morning, including two Metro police officers. After a high-speed chase on the city's southeast side, the pursuit ended with the crash near the corner of South Keystone Avenue and Raymond Street. And that's where we find our TV sits. It's Katie Hines live with details. Shade, we're one block south of the intersection. You can still see the skid marks on the street here where this chase ended. And it's here in this area where police say the suspect crashed his vehicle after hitting a motorcycle at the corner of Keystone and Raymond. And it all started around 9.45 last night. That's when officers tried to stop a driver near Sherman Avenue and Washington Street. They say the officer spotted the driver of a maroon Buick sedan commit an unlawful moving violation. The when that officer tried to pull the driver over, the driver took off, leading police on a roughly three-mile chase southbound on Keystone. The driver crashed into a motorcycle, throwing both the driver and passenger several yards. We're told both are in serious but stable condition. Dispatchers confirmed the two Metro police officers who were hurt uh, were hurt after crashing into one another while trying to stop the driver. The good news, though, all parties involved are expected to make a full recovery, but still people living in this area say they're startled. Once again, it's a major concern because this is where I live right now and this is happening in my neighborhood. And so that was my concern, you know, make sure everybody was okay and, you know, see what had happened. Police have taken the suspect into custody, also transported that person to Eskenazi Hospital in stable condition this morning. No names released at this point, but certainly we'll bring you more details as we get them. For now, we're live on the southeast side. Katie Hines, RTV6.